If you're having trouble setting your target framework to be .NET 6.0 or 5.0 like this, let me show you how it is done. I'm going to start a brand new application and I'm going to show you where the problem is and how you can remediate that. Let's get started. Okay, once the project loads, right click on your main project here and you go properties and under the application tab on the left hand side, if you look at it by default, there's no 6.0. I know on this machine itself, I did install .NET 6.0, but however, this is not showing up here. So another way to check whether you have 6.0 installed or you haven't done installation of 6.0, click on this guy here or open a web page and go ahead and install the specific architecture that you have. Once the installation is complete, you can check the status of installation by going to start. VS installer and you go modify and go individual component here you should see a checkbox next to it this is another way to install your dotnet framework if you want to so once the installation is done it takes like 5-10 minutes I'm not too sure depending on the speed of your network once that's done and this will still not be available even if you start your component here or your project here and the way to do it would be to this first right click on your project unload the project it should show unloaded and this should come up here in here what you're gonna do just change it to net 6.0 and what you're gonna do is control s to save it and let's close it and now you're gonna go ahead and reload the project in there and let's close this here as well now and if you go right click now and go properties on the application you'll see that you have an option for .NET 6.0